Aries women and Pisces men. And hi, my name is Maven. I'm a singer songwriter. And go check out my music if you haven't already. And ignore my makeup stains on my white t-shirt because I'm just not one of those people who have the capacity to keep my white shirts clean. Anyways, yeah. I'm gonna see you on some of your astrology and welcome. Aries woman, Pisces man. Aisha Curry and Steph Curry. And it's given what it's supposed to give. Automatically, when I saw it, I'm like, yup. 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 Oh, that, okay. The reason why I say yup, because the Pisces man needs the Aries woman to thrive. So, with that rating, I'm already going to give it a 10 out of 10. Oh, first 10 out of 10. Yup. 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 The reason why I say this, because the Pisces love, Pisces men or Pisces people in general like to bet on the greater good of humans to get that spiritual reward from the universe. And what that means is, Aisha betted on um, Stephen Curry since they were young. They've been together forever. That he was going to be a star. That he was going to be that guy. And sure enough, sure enough, even though she's the Aries in the relationship compatibility, sure enough, it's like everything he manifested happened because he had the support of a woman. Because I believe women are for God. And you know there are very religious, spiritual people, people who really care about their um, beliefs. And the fact that their beliefs manifested and they're like this power couple. Yup. 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 Okay. <laughs> like, I'm excited talking about this because... There's a lot of other astrologers who believe that it may or may not work. I believe it do work. In some instance, water and fire does work because it creates that steam versus the smoke effect. And it's always steaming because the Aries is all about themselves. And the Pisces man is going to feed off of her resilience and confidence and apply it towards himself. That's all, that's all Pisces do. They want to mold. Take the energy that you have and mold and to heal it. But the fact that this is the Aries only generates big energy, big, powerful passion, passion, the power, the persuasion to get your goals and power and with patience and persistence. It's, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Sex is beautiful because we know Aries is all about whoosh, the Big Bang. Pisces is all about imagination. It's like that man is in La La Land. When he's with any Pisces man, he's like La La's man. La La, 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 La La's man. <laughs> La La Land with the Aries woman. Because anything you put your mind to, you can have and you can achieve if you believe. Aries are very much egotistical. I don't care what nobody says because it has the ego of a child. I could do anything with or without guidance because I came from God itself. And she that's a woman at that. Aries too, only Aries and Pisces revert to the source for anything. Not material matters. Not words. Not anything else. But the source. In this couple dynamic, the source is God. Where did you come from? Positivity. Creativity. That could be your source. And you follow that and look how great things could be if you just put your mind to it. And when this relationship dynamic goes about it, Pisces man is very loyal to this person that's been giving them all this faith. And I feel like the bodily grows and grows and grows and grows and grows. And the Pisces men try not to get caught up in anything of a lower nature when dealing with the Aries woman. I will say, I had a bit of timid, little stupid, manipulative ass Pisces. Man, it could be a toxic relationship like any other love compatibility, okay? But in this dynamic, right? 
from what it is usually the one thing i noticed too with a lot of um, pisces men they tend to have venus and aries so venus is the um, planet that represents your love interest and how you attract greater things in life out of luck whatever not jupiter but venus through the feminine energy even though venus and aries is a detriment if you attracted aries woman it almost like it's like cancels it out because it forces you to go get what you want because she's not going to stop for you she ain't going to think about it twice and that's going to motivate a man itself because men only know themselves by actions not by words only going to motivate the man to work harder the only obstacle can be is because aries woman sometimes doesn't want to always be this alpha energy sometimes like most women they just want to be taken care of they just want to relax wind down be one with you it's like sometimes pisces too can lose their self and their identity in their relationship and that's another conversation a lot of people try to avoid because pisces is a healer 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 but one thing i will commend pisces for is sticking it through no matter what people say stick it through because like with pisces too they're so dreamy so imaginative so creative so sensitive to the point where you know after you've been with somebody for some time you shared each other's dna your dna starts to bold because of the number of intimate acts that you do together it's like the level of spiritual empathy that the pisces man has towards his area was like if you hurt i hurt if you rage i rage if i'm frustrated i'm gonna take it out of my passions pisces are not aggressive people it's very rare that you really see pisces acting in the lower nature it's very rare so how the pisces man will view this relationship is like this my everything and i think it's such a beautiful connection it's a beautiful connection and you know pisces men too they get deemed as one of the weaker zodiac signs and is hey, hey listen majority doesn't mean all right but i feel like a lot of men are tapping into the divine masculinity because pisces men too they like to fix problems they like to fix things. They like to heal things. And whereas if the Aries, let's just say if the Aries woman wants to have a yelling match because, you know, Aries women are notorious for their spicy behavior. Pisces man is not going to throw gasoline onto the fire. He's not going to be like a Virgo just underneath you. He's going to let you have your moment. He's going to basically marry you, let you have your moment, do what you got to do. Probably not going to lose his temper once. You're probably going to be like, you all right? All right, cool. Get over it. And let's move forward. Can I buy these pair of shoes? <laughs> Just sweet. Like, they're non-confrontational men. That's one thing I give Pisces men. Non-confrontational men. That's one thing I commend them for. So, all in all, it is a 10 out of 10 relationship to me. I, I don't know why I've been giving out these tens. I usually don't. I'm always looking for the defects. But because, you know, it does have the capacity. Who did I have? Yeah, I did have the Yisha Curry and Stephen Curry underneath my list for a celebrity. It does have the capacity. If you're Aries woman or Pisces been watching this, I think, like, you know, from a woman to woman, viewing this thing, never stop believing yourself, never stop prioritizing yourself, and never stop putting your beliefs and your self love first. Now, I feel like that's the only way a man can really love and respect you. And that's why the Pisces man loves and respects this woman. Because she ain't care about them little boys. I got my own thing. She not worried about y'all. And that's what attracts the Pisces man. Like, she not worried about y'all. How can I get to her? Because, mind you, right before Aries is Pisces. So, they got a little bit of each other's energy there because Aries is a fucking crybaby. Excuse my language. But Aries is a crybaby. I added that out because I got a little classy. But Aries is a crybaby. So, and Pisces too. They're mutable. An immutable person, a mutable, mutable sign, you're crossed between fixed and cardinal, where it's being the leader or being stuck. It never works. It never, like, they're always transforming is what I'm saying. And if a man is with you, he's 
women feed off your energy because when I keep telling you, women are straight from God. Women are the closest thing from God. Closest thing to God. If Pisces too, because like I'm saying, he's very like sensitive. I'll say that I'll tell you that. Very empathetic. If he feels your energy is off, he's gonna get thrown off. And he's he's not gonna be you know, Pisces don't like confrontation. So if the ghost thing happens, let that man go. Go be with some weakling. I don't know. But me and team. That's all I got. Every one on Pisces man. Let me know if you love this love compatibility videos. You want to make me my con request one. Go to the mean team tab and book a one-on-one -on -one consultation and request a love compatibility video. Yes, silly. Yes, silly. Yes, silly. Yes, silly. Okay, but yeah, I'm just I'm just hype. I'm technically supposed to be asleep, but that's all I got. So I subscribe and check out my music videos. Alright, bye me team.